Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel. My name is Razel. Hope you enjoy! Don't forget to like and subscribe and comment down below. Hello everyone! Today is a plant tour. I'm gonna show you guys all my beautiful, beautiful, gorgeous babies. So, I've got almost 400 plants in this whole house. Last year, I promised I'm not going to buy plants anymore when I hit 300 plants. <laughs> but I lied. <laughs> I see a lot of beautiful plants all the time on Facebook, Etsy, everywhere. So it's keep growing, guys. It's tempting. It's addicting. So I'm going to show you guys all my new ones. I ordered plants from Indonesia so and I order here from Etsy everywhere here in Florida California so I'm gonna show you guys all my beautiful babies right here in my house let's go So guys, a lot of people know that I love plants. Yes, I love them. I love plants. Plants is my stress reliever. Plants is my happiness. I'd rather spend my time to my plants than anybody else. I don't want to go outside. I just want to hang out with my plants every day. Because plants, they don't harm you, they don't hurt you, they will love you. That's why I love plants. They don't stab you on your back. All they're gonna do is love you. So plants is my happiness. So I hope you guys enjoy my plant tour. I just wanna share you guys my happiness. My happiness is my family and my plants. I've got common plants, uncommon plants, so stay tuned guys! So right here guys is my propagating station. I've got all kinds of beautiful cuttings right here. I've got albo singonio, tomato seeds, and I've got pink princess, repetipora tetrasparma. I've got all kinds of cuttings right here. And then I've got plants coming. I think five varieties. It's a rare plant. Came from Colorado. I ordered from Etsy and I can't wait. So let's start right here. This is my fig tree. Beautiful one. She's getting so big and I've got angel wings, begonia, Pelanopsis orchids, Hoya carnosa, and aluminum plants. And right here is my beautiful huge puzzle frame. And another angel wings. Just ignore this. And right here is my Pelodendron Brazil. I cut that back. And this one is umbrella plant. We call this umbrella plant in Philippines. And I've got a lot of that one. Here is another one, a beautiful one. So guys, this is our first dining area. I just paint this one and redo everything and rearrange everything. So I love it. I love the look. And here is my jade plant. 
so this is the look right here it changed everything and another angel wings and more Peladendron Brazil and Golden Pottos and Adansonyai. I love the trailing. I just got that back too. I propagate everything in my plants. Spider plants, purple heart. And right here we're on upstairs now spider plants love the veining I love the trailing so gorgeous and right here is my favorite I think everything is my favorite this is uh, Adam Sonia but it's a narrow form skinny one And here is the overlooking. You can see my big tree right there. That's my huge Picus Benjamina. So that tree, the original owner of that one, she passed away. So I keep it and now she's growing. It's almost three years in my hand, in my care. And more umbrella plant. And more babies right here. I've got a lots of small plants right here. And this is my second propagating station. This is my exercise room and my daughter's playroom as well in my plant room, so. We share. <laughs> she play in here. I exercise here and see my babies, all my plants. So, guys, I promised before that I'm not gonna buy plants anymore, but look, it's always tempting me. I see all the time in the Facebook group plant groups oh my gosh it's crazy now it's growing my collection is growing and probably after all this you know all this propagating thing if I pot it it's gonna be like 600 plants I've got so this is ponytail palm and that's what my daughter said mommy stop buying plants can't. It's addicting. It's nice outside. So all the angel trumpet, I put that outside and this banana plant tree, I put that outside as well. So look at all these gorgeous cuttings. I've got tons of them. I got Albo Singonium here, Bloody Mary, Painted Lady, I've got Variegated Calamansi, Gloriosum, Bifenifolium, Variegated String of Heart, and String of Nichols, Hoya Crimson Queen, Hoya Abubara, Wandering Jewels, Tradiscantia Nanook, Peladendron Brazil, and this is the beautiful shamrock, purple shamrock, and my beautiful banana plant. I love it. Look at that. She bounced back because when we go to Philippines for a month, when we come back, that's like bone dry, like almost dead. But I'm happy she is still alive. A lot. Look. Oh my goodness. This is strawberry cream singonium, a baby. 
trio star that's a pink alocasia dragon so look at all of this beautiful mother nature this is in our gym room and more right here <laughs> I've got a lot of cuttings I'm taking advantage because of the weather it's spring right now and if you propagate now the summer is coming so they're gonna grow quick so I love it so here is, is our office I've got only I think few plants right here I think five yeah because this is north facing window so it's not much light so I just put a little bit right here I got money tree and me and my daughter sing right here as well I've got tons of karaoke here I think three of them <laughs> and let's go to our bedroom and this one is the heart leaf philodendron I got this back as well I think I cut like two feet for this one because it's getting long so I propagate her this is the snake plant and this is my side I got this beautiful wandering jewels right here and the lemon lime heart leaf philodendron I mix with the dark one the green I always mix them because it's gorgeous and here in our ba bathtub is my monstera deliciosa I already cut her to propagate mrs. monstera and I've got a lot of plants right there but I put it down so let's go down and see my babies and you can see right here our living room tons of babies every day when I go down here it's so relaxing and I say good morning ladies and gentlemen <laughs> every day and my daughter said are you crazy mommy <laughs> no I'm not I'm just talking to them and say hi say good morning like I tell you every morning good morning so this one is a diva if I forget to water this one it's like dead but if I water she bounces back it's amazing that's petonia I think this golden poros is looking great beautiful and this is my big tree the picos benjamina this is almost three years in my care like I said the owner of that is she passed away it's a sister of my husband grandma so this is Florida Beauty Stardust and more golden pottos they're healthy and shiny and very clean I always wash them and this that one is the red emerald and this is the story of my COVID because me and my husband both got COVID for the COVID survivor and right here is my snake plants five varieties right here I plant them in one pot Padding right here is my beautiful purple shamrock again this is amazing at night they sleep as well the leaves close they're sleeping too and this one 
is the Hawaiian potos. The original leaves of this one is huge. It's like a Monstera Deliciosa. And I got Macolata right here. That I propagate. She got a new growth. Tiny, tiny leaf. And same right here. Got new growth as well. So this is our wet bar. And right here is my huge parlor palm. I've got this in Cheyenne, Wyoming. We lived there for nine years in Cheyenne. My husband stationed there for nine years in Air Force Base. So she's doing great. She's huge. And this one I bought in New York. More wandering jewels. And another begonia. Different kind of begonia. I forget the name. But I love the leaves. It looks like a stars. Gorgeous. So I've got tons of that one. I've got another orchid. And this, guys, is so sad. Oh my gosh, what's going on, baby? He looks so sad. I don't know what's going on. Why he's browning, I don't know. So guys, let me know what you guys think, what happened to him. So this one is my beautiful monster Alba Monstera Borsigiana. This is the mother plant. I cut her to propagate as well. I've got a tons of cuttings. And here is my calamansi tree, but never got fruit yet. And my elbow singonia. I cut this as well to propagate because if I bought one cutting for this, it's expensive. So I just got it and I've got more. Happy me. <laughs> and this beauty is looks so sexy. This is another pelodendron, but her name is a different number, 69686, that's the name. <laughs> Another strawberry cream syngonium, this is the mother plant. More aluminum plant propagating. And right here is she's from Indonesia. She just got here. This is a Pelodendron Glorious. She's beautiful. Carrii. And this one is the Variegated String of Heart. I cut her as well. <laughs> now there's a new growth. And this is my daughter's plant. I give this to her. Valentine's Day and she take care of it That's her plan. So I've got Kalan Kowi here My only one and my string of pearl in there is Hanging in there <laughs> And this is the modern plant of a uh, string of turtles Getting huge Actually, guys, I cut this back because it's go all the way in our sink and it's not good because this is easy to break. So I cut it and propagate. So here is mix. I've got 
Scandapsis exotica, Hartley philodendron, and Brazil. So here is my bamboo plant. He's doing great, Mr. Bamboo. Dwarf banana plant, more Pelonopsis orchid. I got tons of this. And this is Mrs. Lily, the variegated peace lily. And she's flowering. Mrs. Lily gave me a flower and gorgeous. Lots of beautiful flowers. Every morning when I drink my coffee right here, I see all these beautiful plants, beautiful flowers, colors, different kind of colors. And the leaves, different kind of shape of leaves. So it's so gorgeous. Mother nature is beautiful. Look at that beautiful color. And this is my neon plant, Pottos. And this is my Bionic, but I can't say it. <laughs> Bipenipolium, Bipenipolium. And right here is, she's from Philippines. She's doing great. She got two leaves, and this is Mr. Pedatum. Pedatum? Yeah, the name is Pedatum. And money plant. Wandering jewels. I just cleaned this one because there's a lot of dry leaves. And here's the top cutting of my Alba Monstera. And more propagation here, just nodes. I've got tons of nodes right here. This is, we call this in Philippines, it's a fortune plant. But this is Dracaena. I bought that in Ikea. Another Maculata, the mother plant. She's gorgeous, I love it. Watermelon, Peperomia. This one, I forget the name. And right here is my lipstick plant. And this is all the cuttings, the leftover from my Alba Borsigiana. Cause some of them, I think five of them are sold and this is for me. I'm gonna keep this. I've got, I think six cuttings. So I think one more week, I'm gonna transfer this to soil because there's a lot of roots already. So one more week, guys, hang in there. And this one is my Alba Syngonium cuttings and I've got a bunch of node right there. I just stick in there. So here is my burdle mark. I can't say it now. Too long. The video is too long. <laughs> this one is Alocasia Dragon, Silver Dragon, I believe. Enjoy Pottos. My Pink Princess, the top cutting. And this is a uh, neon. Pelodendron, I think goddess, I don't know, I forget the name. And this one is the Hoya Carnosa. More Swiss cheese plant at Ansonia. A variegated Peperomia. And this one, I put the, I'm gonna put the name because I forgot. This is Dying. <laughs> This is Calithia medallion and I don't like it. I don't like Calithia now. They're very picky. And this one, my painted lady, Mrs. Painted Lady, 
I got this back and now she got a new growth coming another bipennifolium it's hard to say yet and more syngonium beautiful bipennifolium and my cans I love my cans guys the leaves itself is velvety and this is Hindu rope Hoya compacta and another philodendron it's a brantianum more string of har uh, no string of turtles sorry manjola i got this back and hoya crinkles and this one is gloriosum silver sword philodendron i cut this back and now he's growing gorgeous and more neon plants pottos so this is right here guys this is our second dining room every morning i sit down here for my coffee and you can see all this beautiful gorgeous babies right here so this one is heart leaf i think this is scandin scandin it's huge so i cut this too to propagate and more aransonia this is a white form and this one bromeliad i put in the pineapple thing is that it look like pineapple and right here she is from indonesia a baby one anthorium crystallinum and this big girl i've got this last year i bought an ebay i think only it leaves a tiny one and now she's growing and i propagate her and i've got three plants now i'm so happy look at that gorgeous veining it's beautiful like they're uniform and if you see the stripe guys the veining that's like silver it's just if there's a light it's glittery it's so gorgeous and velvety leaves right here is more anthorium crystallinum there is the and this one is the most diva my husband bought this for me and she's gorgeous 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 this is japanese variegated adansonia and she's expensive gorgeous plant and this one is my pika steneki i love the color it we call this a daddy's plant because my husband is a military and their uniform is look like this it's camouflage so we me and my daughter called daddy daddy's plant mother of watermelon paper Romeo. and here's my variegated picus benjamina she is doing great i've got this very tiny and now look she love her life nicely and this is repetipora tetras parma i cut this back as well because she's almost touching our ceiling and another here is my marble pottos and here is sibyl blue and i hear sibyl blue is came from philippines but i don't know and i cut this as well to propagate more i love the color of that it's like bluish here is bloody mary and variegated jade plant more dracaena
more Bloody Mary and Thanksgiving cactus and this one is string of hearts it's not variegated just the regular one and I've got two of them right here they're getting long and I need to cut them as well to propagate and this one is my money tree doing great look it's clean no dust I always wipe them that's all I do guys I don't work so this is my full-time job I just stay home Take care of all my babies. And this is my medium piddly pig. Gorgeous. And this one is my huge piddly pig. This is the huge one I ever had. And I cut this back because it's almost touching in our ceiling as well. So I cut it and I'm gonna show you guys the cutting she's doing good as well i've got desert rose variegated jade plant and this is the black cardinal hoya obubara hoya carnosa and more chinese money plant and this one is another rubber tree this is I got a uh, yellow variegation. Forget the name, I think, of this I'm gonna write it down the name. And this one is my French of Orange. And more umbrella plant. This is variegated one. We're almost there, guys. Bear with me. <laughs> Almost. This is Birkins Pelodendron. I love the variegation of that one. It's dark green. Look, gorgeous. Here is Alocasia Pink Dragon. This one I just ignored before. I really don't like it. And look, the more she mature, the more so gorgeous. I love the veining of the leaves. That's the new leaf. More Pelodendron Brazil. And here is Mrs. Polly. This is Alocasia Polly. I call her Mrs. Polly. And Hoya Crimson Queen. Gorgeous. I got this bag as well. And top as more golden potos and mix with pelodendron brazil i always mix them because it's look gorgeous i love mixing plant guys if you see something that you want to ask just message me and i will reply you back and this one got reverted this is all the syngonium i cut it back Hopefully, it's coming back the variegation because I love the marble color. Look, it's gorgeous. But she gets reverted. So, guys, this is the cuttings of that piddly pig. She's doing great. She's just living her life nicely. And I put two, of, two plants in here. More Mrs. Monstera Deliciosa and more begonias. Gorgeous. Beautiful plants. Just let me know, guys, if you guys got a question. And I'm going to reply as soon as I can. Here is Madagascar Dragon Tree. I believe beautiful as well yeah Madagascar 
Orvifolia, gorgeous, gorgeous. And more Tria Star. Stromantis Tria Star. That's Galithia. And here is Burrito. <laughs> I don't know the name. It's Burrito. I don't know if that's real. This one is Candapsus Exotica. It's Candapsus Pictus Exotica. Gorgeous. I love it. This one is my variegated vanilla orchid. I got that as well to propagate. And more umbrella plant here. Look at the design. She's just leaning right there. <clears throat> I love it. Bromeliad. More Pelanopsis orchid. And this is snake plant. This one I forgot the name. Rick Rack. This one I know. Rick Rack. I love it. Pelanopsis orchid. My prayer plant. Red Maranta. I love the veining. And more Syngonium. I love Syngonium, guys. More watermelon, peperomia, propagating Chinese money plant. And right there is my top cutting for my painted lady. Mrs. Painted, painted Lady. This one is Saloom. Beautiful. It's a pelodendron as well. I love pelodendron. And this one, more pelodendron, is the Rojo Congo. Huge. And there's new baby coming. I love this plant. Huge. Love horse. And more Rojo Congo. And this one is Mrs. Monstera Deliciosa. She's getting big now. She just love her life right here. And it's weird, guys, because I always talk to my plants. Another bromeliad. And even they don't talk to me, they give me happiness. And right here is my huge Monstera Deliciosa as well. So that's it, guys. I'm sorry for this long, long video. I hope you guys enjoy my video. I know it's boring because it's planned, but I just want to show you guys. I think a lot of people that love plants they will appreciate this one so right here one more <laughs> i got one more right there that is a uh, calithia stromanti tria star so i've got more plants on, in our basement i think eight of them but i'm not gonna go there it's cold so here you go guys look at the holes beautiful mrs monstera deliciosa this is the cuttings propagating them so all right guys hope you guys enjoy thank you guys so much for watching and always stay safe this boring video I hope you guys like it and let me know guys don't forget to like and subscribe and share